to my travel diaries in Europe. I am so excited because I just landed in Nice, France. I have the most beautiful view I've ever seen. Like, are you kidding me right now? This is just beyond. This is the most beautiful view ever. And even when you come into the kitchen, you have this nice view and there's no curtains. So every morning when I wake up, I get to wake up to this gorgeous view. I'm starting to think I should have booked this for a little bit longer. I already have a feeling this is gonna be one of my favorites. But yeah, I just got in from the airport and I'm just unpacking my stuff right now. I have an activity plan for today. I'm doing a, a walking tour of Nice, which is about 40 minutes away from here. So everything in Nice is super spread out. I'm staying in right by Monaco, like in the little town next to Monaco. The tour is in like central Nice. Okay, I am all ready to go. I'll show you my dress in just a moment. I got it when I went to Amalfi. If you watched that vlog, I did a little bit of shopping there. This is the dress. I'm so obsessed with it. It's so cute. One of the little shells is like I need to get it fixed when I get home. But yeah, I'm gonna go eat brunch and then I have my tour. I scheduled a dinner reservation for later tonight and then I'm gonna come back because I have a boat tour tomorrow morning. It's like with a little group I booked on Get Your Guide. That's where I've been booking all of these things. Like not sponsored at all, but I love Get Your Guide. But yeah, let's go grab some food. On the tour of Nice, we got to have a local guide show us through the old town of Nice. We went all the way up to the top at the castle and just walked around and really admired the beauty. We did an olive oil tasting test. She showed us all the local churches that date back to the 1300s, which I just thought was insane. But she was amazing. I actually booked this through Get Your Guide. I love booking activities through there. And overall, it was an incredible experience. All the years of incline walking at the gym prepared me for Europe. I'm dying, but my steps are <laughs> they're slaying, so on my way home. Good morning, it is day two here in Nice in the south of France. I am so excited because today I have a boat tour. We're boating around to a few different areas, hopping in the water. They serve us like food, I'm pretty sure, and drinks. So it's gonna be so fun. I booked this on Airbnb actually. They have like experiences that you can book. I just woke up this morning and of course saw this beautiful view and it is just, it's surreal. It really is. The boat port right now. The breakfast place was so delicious. They gave me so much food though, and like I felt bad I couldn't eat it all, but it was so delicious. And I'm super excited for this boat ride. about 6 a.m. exactly it comes up at 608 and I have about 12 minute walk so I kind of need to hurry Good morning, well, officially good morning. I have been up since 5.45 this morning. I went to the beach this morning. It was lovely. I took a little dip in the sea and I went to go eat breakfast at Edmund's Cafe. It was really delicious. Came back, I showered because my hair was just, it needed to be washed. It was very sea salty, oily, you get the picture. So I just got ready. 
I'm wearing this cute little dress from Zara. I'm about to go to Monaco. But yeah, it's a beautiful day. It rained a little bit this morning. It was no big deal, but I did have to Uber back because trying to like get to the bus stop when it was just pouring down rain was not the vibe this morning. But gosh, I just love it here. This is my favorite place ever. Last night, I ended up going with some of the girls that I met on the boat to grab dinner. I love doing Airbnb and get your guide experiences because you really meet some great people. Today is going to be great. I'm super excited to check out Monaco. I don't think I'm going to spend that long there. I'm just going to go to Monte Carlo, maybe go in the casino. I've never like gambled before. I'm just not into gambling. Like maybe I'll do $20 or something. <laughs> I'm back here, get my swimsuit on and Go to the beach, so let's go. Just eight and we are on our way to Monaco. Another guy looking for the perfect just got back from the beach and I took a little body shower. I just changed into this little white dress. I have my bag, my bag that I made in Paris and I have a dinner reservation at eight o'clock. It's 7.29 right now and the bus leaves at 7.34. So I'm gonna zoom down to the bus stop, go eat dinner and then come back here and pack because it's my last day. I feel like I could have done longer in Nice. I could have done one or two more days for sure, for sure. Like next time I come, I'm gonna have to extend it a bit. Going to this place called Dry Restaurant and Bar, so let's go eat dinner. My hair is crazy, but it's the last day I'm heading to the bus stop to go eat some breakfast. Good morning. I woke up this morning. I went to go eat breakfast at this lovely brunch restaurant called Clay. It was delicious. Let's look at the view one last time. Like, I'm just, it's stunning. Absolutely stunning. Most beautiful place ever. I did extend my stay till one o'clock just because I wanted to have time to enjoy this morning and not rush around. My flight's not till 4.30, so I was like, I'll pay 20 euros to stay until one. Like, I love it here. I can't leave yet. I'm just about to call an Uber and head to the airport. The elevator is broken in the building I'm staying in, so I do have to carry my luggage down five flights of stairs. This place was so worth the view. Like, this guy is getting five stars. He's getting, like, an amazing essay review. I will insert the name of the Airbnb in the comments since I'm no longer staying here, obviously. If you ever come to the south of France, stay in Villefranche sur Mer. It's beautiful. Everyone I've talked to says this is like one of their favorite places to stay. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really, really hope you enjoyed it. I have been having so much fun making these travel vlogs. If you want to see more vlogs, I have tons of videos before this one that I filmed, wonderful cities I visited, why I was studying abroad and then solo traveling. And then I'm gonna have two more Europe vlogs after this. But when I get back to the States, I'm gonna be going on a few more trips. So we'll have some travel vlogs from there. But yeah, make sure to follow me on Instagram at Kaylee Itzwig, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.